perform real good tomorrow, if I do real good tomorrow, hopefully they give me a shot. I mean, it's a big fight. I'll be in a big NABF champion that put me in the top ten. So, I mean, I can, I can fight these guys. I know it's true. Yeah. He did good. He did good. Uh, just, just like any up and coming fighter, he, uh, he did real good in that fight. He did what he had to do. He went and knocked the guy out. Um, a couple things, you know, a couple little things that he can improve on, but he's, he's still, he's still new. So you can't ask for anything better than what he did. He took care of business. You were his position in 12 an hour. That's right. That's right. My advice to Jose Benavides Jr. is to, to tr work harder than everybody else and to um, stay healthy. Do whatever you do, but keep your hands good and keep your body good because it takes the little things like that that will take it from you. Yeah. yeah, well, it is because. Uh, you know, I've been, I've been in a position where, where nobody's helping me, you know, so, so when you help people, I just, it's just my way of, it makes me feel better. I mean, I can't give them money because I don't have it, but, but I can give them support, and, and, and by that, I feel good doing that. You know? Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Mexico going to see this, man. So it's awesome. Really? 
Yeah. yeah. I got him a Hevel Seal Sonora, our Prieta Sonora, and then Chihuahua Chihuahua, you know. Is your family yeah. going to be there? Chihuahua. Your wife and your son going to be at the fight? Uh, well, my wife is, she's, I think she's eight months, eight months pregnant. Oh, she's huge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, man, I'm recording this. <laughs> but she's good huge, right? Yeah, she's good huge. She's is that with your second kid? Second kid, yeah. This will be good. My number two, yeah, my second kid. But my wife is big and, and it's the move, the baby is active. At night time, I can see that thing move, you know. Oh, it's a, girl, it's a girl. boy. Yeah, uh, everybody's. Oh, no, I got Ernie already. We already got it. Ernie. Uh, it's gonna be, uh, I think, Julian, Julian. So. Uh, how old is Julian? He's four now. He's four, and he's. I perceive. If I brought him here, man. He'd be up those escalators, man, and he'd be going around. <laughs> is, he, is he earning the third? He's earning the third, yeah. Probably the last. If you had something to say to your dad right now, what would you say to him? My dad? Uh, he's over there. <laughs> yeah, what would you say to him behind the scenes? Like, hey, yeah. dad. Come wuss. <laughs> yeah, I always do that. But it's only between me and him, you know? Uh, oh, okay. Oh, man, He's, I recorded he does, this. He does the same thing to me, you know? He's like, uh, what up, boys, you know? Uh, <laughs> you know you were getting some sparring in with uh, Billy Schmidt? Billy Schmidt, yeah. Talk about that? Yeah, it was good. They helped me out a lot, man. Uh, Billy Schmidt and Ali, uh, or Roberto Young, yeah. was fighting on his bar. Uh, they were good, man. Two different styles, man. And, and you got, you know... I'm fighting a guy who's six foot one, same height as Roberto, so that was great. And Billy Schmidt is, you know, aggressive and he's a pretty hard puncher, so he comes at you, man, and and uh, he makes you he makes you fight. So I had the best of both, you know, had a banger and had a guy running around the ring, running real hard to hit. So it was good. You think both of them win their fights too? Mm. They got good. They got hard fights. I'm not gonna make you predictions yeah, yeah, yeah. on those fights, man. Because uh, they're, I know every single body in the, that's fighting on this card, and, and they're, they're all my friends. So I just wish them all good luck, you know. And and, and they were part of my team for this fight, so it's good. One more last question. So after the fight, where are you going, Disneyland? Shoot. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna go over, I'm going to the after party, wherever it's at. <laughs> see, see if the wife's up to it at least, you know? Uh, <laughs> the major preparations tough for Francisco just obviously, you know, you can drop down yeah. time, but for a, a week to prepare for a guy who's six one, the guy who's experiences as he is. Well it, it's um it, it, to make the switch was not hard because I already had a tall guy sparring with me. Um, I just don't have to bend down as much. You see, my thing is when I'm fighting fighting fighters, I like to be underneath them. And um, him uh, with Buchanan, I was taller than him. He's only 5'8", really, you know? He's not as... So I would have to... I was bending my legs a little more and I was trying to get underneath them. But now... I got a big tall guy. I can I can be I can stand straight up and be underneath him. Just don't just don't get hit by him because I know he can punch, man. You know, he's 24. He got 22 knockouts out of 24 wins. I know he can crack. You ready to fight anybody though? Oh, that's it. I just want to fight. I heard they call you King Kong now. Oh no, King Kong ain't got none on me. <laughs> <laughs>